Hi everyone, my name is Akanayane Patrick Obut. Uh, I'm a Nigerian. I, I also work in Nigeria. I'm a lecturer in the Department of Agricultural Economics and Extension in Nandi Azitwe University here in Nigeria. And um, I came across uh, evidence-informed uh, decision making in 20, uh, that's 2019, and I I started following, and uh, I'm going to talk about why I fell in love with evidence informed uh, decision making. Uh, evidence informed decision making is uh, one of the platforms that uh, really uh, we use our evidence for human, both human and uh, societal development. I remember in 20. 19 when uh, we went through evidence uh, informed decision making we were sponsored to South Africa and uh, since I I came back from that training I've come to realize because uh, before I, I went into lecturing I was in the development sector and being in the development sector many a times you are push policy makers, you are push the government to do one or two things. And I knew that, that sometimes we achieve uh, our aim, we achieve our goals. And uh, when we achieve our goals, there were not much and there were still some entrances. And one of the entrances was that we were not backing our advocacy with uh, evidence. And when I came back from the training, I now realized that advocacy has to be, uh, has to be uh, more effective when it comes with uh, evidence. From what we are talking about, like in uh, Africa, many of our leaders, they, they really are interested in uh, seeing uh, the evidence of what you are talking about. Many a times they don't believe in the theory aspect of it. So uh, 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 EIDN, that's uh, evidence in foundation making, uh, has helped me build me up and make me realize that uh, if it, uh, uh, outcome of programs, outcome of uh, uh, project, outcome of uh, events is one of the major tools in advocacy, advocacy mechanism. One of the major tools in uh, dialoguing with policy makers and one of the major tools in engaging the policy makers. It, it, it is uh, also one of the major tools that uh, can bring effective I and mean, more impactful and uh, effective uh, result and it is, I, i've come to learn that it, it is one of the necessary tools that uh, makes advocacy more effective and i didn't realize this even when i was working in the women's sector but the uh, my my coming to embrace them i mean coming to be aware of them and becoming a member and part and parcel of that great family i said me realize that advocacy uh, becomes more effective when we bring in evidence, mostly when we are approaching our policymakers and our government. They need the evidence so that they can attend to national and global issues. Thank you.